the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things He's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. I believe that other after you receive uh, what the Spirit is saying, basically what Jesus' uh, uh, definition and explanation of that parable, there's still another level. It may, it's different levels. That's why I was talking about there's, the level. There's a whole other level because, you know, of course I went back and I, I've been reading this thing, meditating on this thing, and, and, and praying about it, and it's, it, it, what I've gotten is, is completely different. Yeah. You know, so it, it's, it's uh, it has truly been a blessing, at least in my life, and I've gotten some clarity uh, on, on some different level meanings that, that this parable has opened up to me. Um, the first was when it was for me specific, when it was telling me my journey from when I first started receiving the word to where I'm at now is basically those different grounds. And it was my growth from milk to meat. So with that being the first thing that was dropped in my spirit, you know, when I was looking at that, and I mean, it's just so vivid of my life in those different areas and how the word has come in to right. my life and then my life responding to that. Right. So then here in this last weeks and Sunday, you know, me meditating on it, it was it's gone to, I tried to do a, a CIT, I just couldn't finish right. the work to keep it, you know, within that parameter. Right. But basically, Go it ahead. was, it, let me see. Oh what yeah, we, 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 we did agree that we ain't got to live into that 15, 18 words, because that's just, that's just a box in, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. God, God can oh. give you a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> yeah. So basically what I was getting is that it's a de it's detailed information or a process given on how the new covenant paradigm shift affects the heart of mankind for work for God's word to manipulate in this physical realm. Okay. So that's what I I was getting. You know, it's like he's explaining this new planet going to operate right in the body of Christ. Hey, hey, but look at this. I and so so got you, I agree with you. And I'm saying is that what I was explaining from my perspective, what I heard, right, was the restatement of Genesis. Uh -huh. All the way, all the way to the the Satan coming into the garden, because what we uh -huh. was talking about before you came in was he gave them in you know 126 and he gave them dominion uh -huh. over the fish in the air. Right? What is dominion? Normally it deals with rulership, kingship, yeah. right? Yeah. And then what you just came to tell in while I'm saying is he told them that he gave them seed, right? That was in 20. <laughs> He said, he said, you will use seed for your meat and you will see you, every tree was produced after its own kind. Mm -hmm. this, is, this is 126. We're reading, because I, I just want to tie in everything I got from the restating <laughs> of the, of this story. Uh, cause you know, I'm a, you know, the fowls, cause you know what I mean? He said the fowls in the air will come and try to eat those seeds, right? Mm -hmm. All right yeah. Now look, 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 so check this out. All right, so we put down here in 29, and then God said, Behold, I've given you every herb bearing seed. Yeah. 
And we, we said that a sower does what? He sows seeds, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. It is that pot and which is upon the face of all the earth and every tree. And to which is the fruit of the tree yield a seed to you it shall be for me. So Adam was talking about the fact is before man fell, even animals were eating, you know, from the, 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 the leaves and the yeah. berries, right? But the point yeah. was that he, he our task was to go and replenish the earth. To to that 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 puts you into a sowing ship, right? Because how am I replenish? I got to sow. Correct me wrong, right? The only way I can replenish something is to mm -hmm. sow replenish. something. Yes, sir. Yeah. Right. Come on now. And and so so then what I'm saying is that then then he then he said because this this is what I'm saying. He said this is a restatement of the story. I'm always talking about the kingdom. Then he was talking about the fowls of the air come to devour the seas. And we know in, in 10 through 20, he says Satan comes when? The, immediately. The don't immediately. Yeah. He comes yeah. immediately, right? And, yeah. and 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 we talked in Genesis 3, what happened? He came <laughs> That joke is showing out. <laughs> he yeah. showed out. And, and it's, it is funny that when because he's he re, restating the story was if you look at genesis 3 the how he got her some of that is some of the tools that he used in the explanation of the parable uh-huh right because it says right here in verse uh with eve what, what did he do so some verse six and when the woman saw that the tree was good for food mm -hmm. Which it was, he made all that stuff. He did trees and all that stuff. But he said that it was pleasant to the eye. Yeah. And a tree to make one wise. To be desired. And, 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 and to be desired, right? To be to be desired, to make one wise. She took the fruit thereof and did eat and gave it unto her husband with her, and they did eat. The 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 but they ate because Satan drew them to the tree. <laughs> the tree. <laughs> and when Jesus explained in the parable, he said, No, you're not this parable. How are you gonna know all other parables? That woman was pulled from the lust of the eyes. I think that's what let me see what he said there. What was the to some of the tools that the Satan used? And uh go back to Mark. Oh, Love the eyes. He did. He, yeah, yeah. Yeah. She saw. She saw there would be something to it to eat. Big one wide. Exactly. And right here, I don't know why they wanted that, but he's. This is the same tune. When he go down to, to uh, when the sower, he said the sower sow the word fourteen, and these are they by the wayside where the word is sown. Because God gave them a word, right? Do not eat from this tree, did he? He gave yeah. them a word. But when they have heard, Satan comes immediately and takes away the word. There was sown in their hearts. It mm. was in their heart. Mm. And, uh, <laughs> wait, it's this one. Very good. That's, that's and, good there. And, 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 and then, then he said, so, so he said, this is about these are they by the wayside, right? He said, uh, wait, where, where I'm at. I left I left off somewhere. He said, I said 15, yeah, right? 15. Sown in the hearts, right? And then 16, and these are they likewise which are sown on stony ground, who when they heard the word, immediately received with gladness, but have no root in themselves. So he's explaining that part, and so it do it but for time. I don't know if Adam never had that word root in their heart or not, but obviously it wasn't rooted enough because afterward with affliction of persecution rise for the word's sake immediately they were offended because i know the boy was offended because he said the woman you gave me i i wasn't gonna even touch that tree you gave me that <laughs> if you hadn't given that woman i would not have did it that woman did it that woman gave me that dog gone fruit <laughs> I, I i i i what do you think about that fruit I, i'm just saying yeah. that so okay that's another one being offended and these are they which are sown among thorns, though, such as heard the word, 
and the cares of this world and the deceitfulness of riches. And there's a part I think got her. And the lust of other things enter in, does what? Choke the word and it becomes unfruitful. Mm -hmm. And that's exactly what happened to them when they allowed that word to, to be drawn, they've been drawn away from that word because of lust and desire. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm saying it so, Bishop, uh, I'm glad you're here. I'm just telling them what I got out of it. I told, we talked about it Sunday. I said that thing is just telling me a restatement of Genesis. 